the achievements made to make your favourite stay how you doing I've had my beard trimmed can you tell I've had the hair did I've had the beard trimmed I'm all ready for the weekend um, I'm also going out tonight I think I might have mentioned that in the last vlog I don't remember I haven't even uploaded the last vlog yet rubbish it is I am a rubbish YouTuber I've never professed to being a um, top notch YouTuber yeah, I am who I am, but I am pretty rubbish. I find it hard to upload, I find it hard to edit. It's just rubbish. <laughs> I just feel like I've logged this now. I've logged this far into my journey that I feel like I've got to carry on. And what will happen is, like, I've had periods where I go, I'm not doing this anymore, and then I'll, I'll get pulled back in. Get dragged back in by all the millions of YouTube dollars. I'm joking. There's no money. There's no money in YouTube at my level. Um, but yeah, anyway, these are my midweek sales. It's been alright. It's been alright. Saying it's midweek. Normally, midweek's a bit of a pants period, but. Um, pants period. <laughs> Sounds wrong. You know what I mean? Bit of a rubbish period of time. Um,. But uh, yeah, it's not been bad. It's not been bad the past few days. Ever since I've took on Lexi's advice, it's been coming in. It's been coming in consistently. So we will carry on. Um, nothing's really happened lately. I don't think so. I've, I've got a return. I've got a return coming back a light shade, which is annoying. They went for a month. A month. A month and they don't want to return it around Christmas. Freaking eye holes. Um, but anyway, well, let's go through. So I'm going to go through the non clothing items first. First, coming up is an item that is actually sold. Oops, sorry about that. It's actually sold before. So let's have a look. I've actually sold this item before. Um, well, it's these motorcycle boots. Oh god, I'm making a run. Chill out. Stop. These are motorcycle boots. These I've sold before. They're on for 35 quid. Somebody sent me an offer of um, 29. They're not in the best condition, as you can see. Um, but these have sold before and then came back when they said that they were too small um so yeah they've sold again so they cost me four quid they went for 29 quid just ven vendrimi vendrimini 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 i don't know if that's how you pronounce it but yeah it's a ven vendram vendrimi vendra mini we'll go vendrimini Vendra Mini Motorcycle Boots, so they cost me £4 for 29 Um I've got... Good Lord! Stop, I've got a piece of jewellery. One piece of jewellery. There we go. What's going on today? I'm just dropping stuff. I'm very proud this now. No. Uh, a chunky... Faux pearl necklace. Um, it cost me like 87p. Ah, a freaking 100 beard cut, as I've said. It's catching on the freaking thing on there. <sighs> See me, Eddie. Anyway, um, yeah, a chunky graduated faux pearl. Let's go. Let's let's go to the um the uh, item title. So as I was saying. Before Lex has been telling me that I need to, you know, stop going chunky foul pearl statement cream, other words, and then necklace at the end. I need to put necklace towards the start of the listing to make to make the people more aware. Yeah, yeah, guys. Okay, so this one it's been listed for ages, but I've copied the um, the title of somebody else. Because I put I put all my titles in capital letters, but this um it's not in all capital, so I've stole it from somewhere. 
But yeah, this cost me eight seven p. This went for eleven quid, which is nice. So eleven quid on the. This is what it says: chunky, chunky fold pearl necklace, statement cream costume jewelry graduated. So that went for eleven. Eleven. Well, right, then we got the badges. Don't fall, you a hole. Jim Jiminy, Jim Jiminy, Jim Jim Jiminy. There we go, right, so we have. Wait a minute, hasn't this one. Haven't I already sold one like this? I swear I've shown you this, or I've sold one like it recently. Um, it's a petite navire, which is basically a little boat in um, French, I think it is. Uh, 21p, that cost me for £2.50. We have a Shetland pony horse head. Just a Shetland pony horse head, that went for 3 99 We have a Christmas Poyoncetia. Poyoncetia. P O I N S E T T I A. Thin badge. That went for a fiver. Uh, we have a couple of Croydon bowling. Um, Pins, so we've got a lapel pin. So is it Croydon Municipal Officers Bowling Club? Um, so we've got a lapel pin and just the crest. Uh, they went for five pounds seventy-five altogether. Yeah, it's five pounds seventy-five to And then we had a badge sale earlier as this morning. And I think we can all agree with this statement. God is love. God is love. That went for two ninety nine. So those are the little bits. Let's get to the clothing. First is an auction it's sold. Um, this went for eight quid. I bought it for eight quid. It's just gone for the cost price. Uh, it's an. I mean, it's a nice jacket to be fair. <clears throat> it is a nice jacket. An M and S Saint Michael. Italian soft. It's a nice, nice jacket. Uh, so yeah, it cost me eight. It went for seven ninety nine on auction. Just me getting rid of some old M&S stuff. Uh, we have a weird fish T-shirt. A weird fish T-shirt, which cost me a pound. What size have we got? Yeah, small. It was. It's in very big. Um, a weird fish t-shirt, keep it rugged t-shirt, um, that cost me a pound, that went for 16 99 so I've originally had it on for 20 and um, it's sold for 16 that, that, right, um, We have a cardigan that I got from store, shout out to store, so this didn't cost me anything. An Ambrose, what is it? Ambrose and Jackson, Jackson, Ambrose and Jackson, um, red cardigan. So that didn't cost me anything. That one for seven quid. Originally on for ten. We have some Wrangler Texas jeans. I like seeing these go because I've got quite a few jeans listed. So when I get a pair of jeans going, I'm like, ew. Oh, they've gone. Um, so yeah, again, these are ones where with the jeans you've got to check the measurements on huge jeans. Um, <laughs> I haven't really been burnt. I'd, 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 I'd say that I haven't been burnt putting the measurements of the jeans on. So like these are a thirty-six waist, thirty on the label. But if you measure them, they're a 36, 27 leg. Um, 
I've actually, yeah, because I, I, I put the the actual measurements on the listing. I think that makes more sense to put the actual measurements on the listing. What it was when I had a wholesale order of the nutty jeans, none of them were the right size. Well, I'd say none of them, maybe two or three were the right size, but the majority of them were the, not the size that were on the label. They just didn't measure anywhere near. Um, so I kind of got into a, a thing of measuring the jeans and then putting the actual measurements on the listing so people know then putting in the description but I've actually been burnt by um, me putting the actual measurements in the description and then somebody saying you've you haven't put the actual measurements on I want to send them back I don't know if they were being sneaky but they're saying you, you put the wrong measurements on the title look on the label it says the measurements of this so what what do you lot do let me know in the comments no one will um, but let me know in the comments if you have a pair of jeans. Do you put the measurements that you get, or do you just go with the label and just stick with the label? Let me know. But uh, these cost me five. Uh, these went for twenty-five quid. Just some Wrangler Texas ones. Uh, Thirty-six waist, twenty-seven leg, but originally a thirty leg. Um, I've got three more. Uh, we have this Suzuki collection jacket. Shown this, I'm sure I did. Sure, I've shown this in a video. Um, so yeah, just a Suzuki collection jacket. Got all logos on there and all that jazz. So this cost me five. No, oh, no, this cost me four pound forty-nine. Uh, cost me four pound forty-nine. It went for twenty-one ninety-nine. Twenty-two quid on that one. Um, yeah, this was a nice sale. This actually went this morning. But what I'm trying to do is anything, I'm, I'm trying to get as much posted as I can in the next couple of days. Because obviously, I'm away on Friday. I won't be able to do a post on one on Friday. Um, but we've got Rohan Winter Fusion trousers. Nice, thick these are. Normally, the Rohans are really, um, really thin. Uh, but I had these on for 35 quid. Somebody sent me an offer of 29.99 and I took it. So yeah, £2.50 these cost me from a charity shop and they've gone for 30. In really good condition. So yeah, 30 quid on there. And then the last one, I'm happy with this. This is another shout out to store. So this one didn't cost me anything. But I'm happy with this one because I've had so many offers on this. And I kind of... I was like, I had it on for 30 originally. I've took 25 now. Um, the person who wants it is someone who sells football tops online. I've gone for the the price that I think it's worth on eBay. Um, they sell football tops on eBay. So it probably will end up being relisted and resold. Um, but they were coming in with 15, 20, and they were like, just going, no, we're not, we're not taking more. You won't sell this for any more than 20 and I'm like, these are the messages I'm going back for. I'm like, okay, I don't really care. Like, <laughs> I'll I'll leave it on. And then yesterday they've just finally gone with 20, 24.99. So I'm, I'm a little bit wary of the fact that they might try and pull a funny one. But what I'll just say to them is just send it back. They're not happy. I'm 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 not gonna like go. Oh, if they go, oh, there was this issue. Can you send me a partial refund I'm like nope 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 not happening you return it but uh, yeah an Arsenal top from 2010-2011 uh, season long sleeved as well Thierry Henry style um, but yeah 24 99 this went for it didn't cost me anything it was from store nice one store if store to store watch it in the videos I don't know um, but yeah so as you can see not that bad Twenty four ninety nine, thirty 30 quid, 29 quid on the boots, a couple of 20 quid tops, so they're not that bad in the last couple of days, um, but we'll see, we'll see how, you know, normally at the start of the month it's pretty alright and then it gets dead around, um, you know, the 15th to the 25th, normally it ends up being my dead period, but also, We've got Christmas coming as well, aren't we? But I think we'll 
I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right, guys. It's not been a bad start in the month. But anyway, I'm going to love you and leave you. That was the midweek sales. Peace out, stay safe, stay beautiful, and I'll see you in my next video.